know that. I thought they had one back here, didn't they? They did, David. Huh? I thought they did. There it is, yeah. Yeah, one. There it is. Well, here we are. Okay, it says. You and me and B. Haven? Oh, yeah. All right. I just, yeah. wanted, to, I just wanted to know. He might have been, you know, it's hot weather. He might misbehave. Well, I'll tell you. I, uh, I was talking politics the other day on the computer, and there's about four of my buddies got into it big time over the, over Hillary and uh, yeah. Trump. You know, I don't talk about uh, uh, politics on this microphone because you can get in trouble. Huh? Yeah. I learned that a long time ago when I worked down at WRX Radio up in Anderson. <laughs> I got on politics one night on my show, and I mean to tell you the biggest mistake I ever made. I had a lot of people just calling me and cussing me, fussing at me. And, uh, well, I can tell you one thing, and I'm gonna talk, I don't talk politics. Uh -huh. But if Hillary gets elected, we yep. got four more years of Obama. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And Whether you know what? Like it or not, I don't know who you're gonna vote for, yeah. but that's, that's well, and, and, and guess what, they'll elect her again. Just like they did Obama. Yeah. And what's going to happen is, in fact, I just read today, my insurance, my company that I got my prescription insurance with, yes. is fixing to go out because of this Obamacare thing. You said, we can't no longer, for what the money's going to, we can't keep it up. They fix, there is five insurance companies that are already folded on the Obamacare thing. Yeah. Right, yeah. You're right. And I mean, you know. I mean, that's, just, that's just awful. And, you know, the thing that gets me is when the man gets up there, the President of the United States gets up there and talks about all the Muslims in this country, what good they've done, and they've never done anything in this country. Mm -hmm. and what's going to happen is the Muslims will take over this country and we no longer going to be America. That's it. i, I got a feeling. Well, you know, believe it or not. Uh, oh, I believe it. If hey, Trump, but I, if, if Trump don't get elected, if things change, mm -hmm. and when he gets elected, how long do you think he's going to last? Somebody's going to kill him within two months. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Here you go, Roger. Hey, probably sooner than that. If they don't get him, if they don't get him before, before then. Before yeah. then. Uh, that's the last video we did to him. Oh, okay. And Frank Hunt, if you will, will he be here tonight? No, he's not coming tonight. He's well, when you see him, give it back. I'll give it to him. If you don't mind. I'll see him too tonight. And I got something for you. He's, uh, he's going down to Casey tonight. I got every hit. I don't know how you like George Strait, but a lot of people need him. Oh, yeah. I got every hit he ever made. Oh, two CDs, right. I'm going to give that to you. And you might want to play it here sometime, you know. Well, we just talking about that. They, they're talking about playing, having some music and just play our music. Yes, yeah. I got a CD player. I'll play all you want. There you go. Yeah. That's just a great player, but I said, I can, I, I got some bigger tiles. I can put some space on it. Yeah, you don't need a whole lot of no ones. I said, we don't need that. We were trying to talk about where, where some way we could have some little fun and raise some money or something. There you go. Just yeah. so I may play some fifties and sixties music. I said, I got all the fifths and sixths CDs you want to hear. <laughs> yeah. Hey, well, like, well, me and him, we'll make you some good ones up. Well, know? I got Fats Domino and Little Richard. Little Richard, yeah. Chuck Berry. Yeah. yeah. I got, I probably got 150 of those CDs, those people. Really? Yeah. That's all you need. That's what they like. That's what we used to play up at, we play at, uh, up at our hot tub room. Oh, really? Yeah. Which hot tubs quit working. I got yeah. Let me ask you, do you know a name, a girl, a woman named Pearl Styles? S T Y L E S. Anyway, I went online and invited people to come down here tonight. And uh, she was telling me that she was on the committee here or something. And somebody they got in, she got into it with somebody down here. But I still invited her to come on down. I said, no, I said come on down. Don't let that bother you. But her name was Pearl Styles. S T Y L E S. Oh, I was just I've been fussing out about it here. I know our general law says you can come in twice. All right. Mm -hmm. Without signing an application being a member. Right. I said, will you people just leave these people alone? I said, because they get ready. It was one lady, she's joined now. In fact, she might be here tonight. Three right. Years. I hope she will. She usually comes out. And they kept, I said, look, will you leave her alone? She's already told me, I've been knowing her for, she's going to join. But in her own discretion, she gets ready. There you go. Right. Just let her work her way what in. What about, I don't care how many times she's been in there. You don't understand that. Uh -huh. I said, I'm a, and, and I am a rule follower, right? I follow rules. No one. Right, there you go. I said, but I also know when you got to do a rule. That's right. And you should, yeah, you do. Okay, do. And they don't they don't realize that. So, like well, last, I would have said, there was one coming last night. The first thing, one of the members of the jump, said, you got to join. 
they drove off more members, more people, more, more potential members mm -hmm. by doing that. I know a couple of ladies that said, we'll never come. And they got one member here, his wife. I mean, I said, look, his wife don't have to join. He can bring her in here 365 days a year if he wants to. Mm -hmm. Now, if it's a girlfriend, she's got to join after so many times. But I said, right. why? She never has to join. Mm -hmm. Her husband never has to join. The woman block there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, that's the rule. But other than that, everybody else that I talked to that's been down here, they love it. But I just thought I'd tell you about that. She said she got into it with somebody down here. She didn't say. She said, I don't never go back down there. Some one of y'all. What are the ladies out there? Huh? She got in with one of the ladies or what? I was, well, she mentioned you, you know. She said. She didn't uh, get in with me because I'm uh, north. Uh, wait a minute. I said, Rod. No. Is it name, one name, Don? Was a guy named Don? That, you, uh, that, that was in your place. D O N, Don. No, that was the only person. No, I, I just mentioned her name back to you. And she, uh, yeah, that's right. I don't she, yeah, but Don is the one she got into it with. She was on some kind of ladies' committee here. And she got into it with them, then one of the guys here. I don't know. I never, and I never she even put that on my face, on my page, and I had to quickly erase it. I mean, I, I, you know, I don't I, know. I, what, I don't go for that. I don't know. What, I don't know. What, I don't. The name don't even ring a bell. For me. Well, no, when I get back to the house, I'll check it out, and I'll call you and let you know. Let me know. Let me yeah, know. I'll let you know. Yeah. I don't um, do Facebook. But she's got curly hair. She probably wears glasses. She's probably about sixty. Yeah. It ain't Pearl, okay, I thought it was Pearl, Pearl Styles. We had a Donna Dixon. That's, that, that's her. And we are so I get her and Pearl, we're Pearl's, so, we're, Pearl's a member of the, I, I'm sorry, Pearl's a member of the American Legion. We are so glad that woman is no longer a member of the Legion. She had, she caused more problems. That's her. More disturbance. We don't want her out here no more. That's her. We don't, in fact, she can't that, come in. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, she's been suspended. She Pearl, can't come into place. Pearl Styles is uh, she's the one that, that don't like the people up there at the uh, at the American Legion. But this woman that you call out, that's her. That's sir. When you said Don, I said okay. She's it, it, like yeah. Don. And uh, in yeah. fact, we had a. I had that's a. That's her name. I had a a uh, meeting in here, and uh, with the territorial manager, right? mm -hmm. he called her down so many times. And that finally he said, and he was, he was like, ma'am, do you want to stay in this meeting or would you like to leave? Mm -hmm. Because I can have you escorted out. I want to stay. He said, fine, and keep your mouth shut. Mm -hmm. That's her. Well, after the meeting, she walked up, she threw her card down, she said, I don't want to be a member anymore. And I thought, thank the Lord. <laughs> so, like, I, I don't know. I had nothing but trouble uh, at that moment. I don't know. She became my friend when she found out I was playing there. And she, she kind of hit me in Stuff about how you like it down there. She's want me to say something bad, I guess, when you get back here. And all I got to say is good stuff about the place. Good. Seriously. Well, I'll tell you what. She you know. That's all she did. Well, that's her name. That's okay. her name. When you start talking about, I like everything you Yeah, well, she's about like that lady, that uh, the Styles woman, uh, uh, Pearl Styles. Uh, that, that. In fact, we had we had uh, charges brought up against her so many times. Oh, that's well. not true. And and. She come in here one night, and I can't do that. And she would not have had any more information. And they let her speak. Mm -hmm. If a Philadelphia lawyer had wrote up her information, I promise you. Sure enough, yeah. And they weren't suspended. I said, oh. fellas, y'all, she called me every name in the book. Ain't that awful? Well, that, that's her then. Yeah. yeah I mean, I, since result. you said it, since you said it, now I'm gonna go ahead and let you know, boy. She. She says she got into it with you. Uh, and a guy named Don. And a guy is a guy named Don too that used to work here or something. That might be the pearl lady on Don, yeah. I can't remember as good. She called me every name in the book. Not because I did anything, because you don't understand one thing. I never raised off. Ain't that awful? I never get mad with nobody. He's shaking his head. That's awful, ain't it? And I mean the world, I'll tell you, the world's getting awful. It is. I mean, it's getting awful. I just praise the Lord that uh, He's gonna be with us tonight. We're gonna have a good little show. We're gonna have a good time. Well, I mean, hey, well, uh, well, I'm gonna have a good time. If nobody else does. There you go. We are. Yeah, we come to have a good time. All right, we're gonna get the show started here, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I'm gonna see if we're there a little bit. Oh, I didn't even got the watch. What time? Yeah.
It's about well, it's about ten after. Is there way you do you always leave them lights on there or to dim them a little bit? I want to turn these off and turn on the wall lights and dim them. How do you do it if you don't mind? Yeah, you know. Okay. We're getting ready to get the show started here. I'm Jimmy Gilstrap, and uh, we're going to be here at about 12 o'clock tonight. I want to thank everybody for inviting me back. So here we go. How's that? Yeah, yeah that, there you go. Thank you, Roger. Y'all people, come on back here. Back at the bar. Come on back here and enjoy yourself. Living on sponge cake. Watching the sun bake. All of the tourists are covered with oil Drumming my sex ring On my front porch swing Smell those shrimp, they're beginning to pour Wasting away again in Margaritaville been here before and seen my show, I gave away a lot of CDs. I got some good ones to give away tonight. The lady wanted to know if I brought them. Yep, I got them right down here. We're going to be asking some questions about Newberry. See how smart you are on Newberry. 
I didn't realize, but there's a lot of famous people from this town. I'm gonna be asked. I bet you don't know the uh, question I'm gonna ask. Newberry. <laughs> Newberry. <laughs> hey, he said Mayberry. <laughs> uh, Newberry got some fine folks down here. Okay, we're gonna just kind of slow it down, just a hair. And do a Merle Haggard. We lost old Merle, y'all. Lost him a couple, couple, three months ago. He was one of the, my favorite singers. My daddy always liked him and Marty Robbins. Here we go. Greatest hits by Gene Watson. 
There you go. Thank y'all for being the first couple. Thank you uh, for being the first couple on the floor. Right, you're welcome. See that? They, they want a CD just by getting up and dancing. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That's good. Everybody happy tonight, I hope. Yeah. That was good. That's where we're supposed to be. We're supposed to be happy. We in a good mood. Let's see. Jimmy? Let me do this one. All right, we're gonna just kind of keep it slow just a little bit until everybody gets in here. No use to being rushing things. Here we go. Look at all this ready. Sitting in the morning sun. I'll be sitting in the evening cup. Watching the ships roll in And I watch the waves get So I'm just sitting on the dock of the bay Watching the time they roll away Sitting on the dock of the bay Wasting time Just 
South Carolina. Anybody ever get up that way? Oh yeah. Boy, it's been hot up there. I know it's been hot down here too. It's yeah, hot. You got it right. It's hot everywhere. Right now, we're going to give away a CD. They asked me was I bringing some CDs. I bring them everywhere I go. Hey, y'all. I didn't realize there's so many famous people down here in Newberry. Uh, I didn't realize it. Okay. Uh, okay, I'm going to ask you questions. If I, I should have brought my glasses in here. Yeah, all right, here we go. Now, I read this online, y'all. Now, this is online. All right. And I always thought Newberry had been a city for years. No. But what year did Newberry actually become a city? What? 1965. Uh-uh. On up. Now, I got this off the internet, so I can hope it's right. But anyway, Newberry became a city legally in 19 what? 1902. No. It ain't too far back. It's, I mean, I, I, that ain't shocked me. 1925. No, it's in the 70s. I have to tell you. 1976. You got it. Who said 76? I said that. You got it. Come on up here and get your free CD. Y'all give him a hand. Everybody wins. Give him a hand. But I did not know that. It, only, it became a city only in 1976. I should have known that because I worked in Newberry Reserve. Really? Yes, How about sir. all the hits by Bob Seger? Thank you. Yes, all the hits. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So you, you know, you learn something all the time, don't you? Yes, sir. Yeah, okay. And this is something else. Me and Jimmy was talking about this on the way down here. Okay, let's see if I can find this here. Okay. All right. Now, now, now y'all got to listen up. Now, some of you might know this, and some of you might not know this. The tallest 
The tallest basketball player in the world, what's his name? No, he's a we'll Chinese guy. The Chinese dude. No, uh, no, no, not what the computer says. I'm going to go ahead and tell you his name. His name is Richard Sly. Y'all know him. It's going to shock you. Uh, he, that's what I was going to ask. That's where he's from. Newberry, South Carolina. The, the guy from China, I don't know about him, but I went online and it says, the tallest, the tallest basketball player of all time is Richard Sly from Newberry, South Carolina. From Newberry College or from the world? No, he's from here. From here, from here, it says Richard Sly. I guess I don't know if he, he he's probably a black man. I guess, but uh, Richard Sly, uh, tallest man in the world uh, that played in basketball from Newberry, South Carolina. Man, it does that. Yeah. All right. Now we're gonna ask this question here. Now y'all gotta holler it out. Okay. Uh, what year was Ronald Reagan born? Nineteen. No, come on down a little lesser, Roger. 1926. Come on back. 1926. Matter of fact, he's older than uh, President uh, John F. 1919 Kennedy. 1919 now. 1922. No. Back. 1921. 1907. Uh, forward. 1909. Forward. 1911. You got it. 1911. Come on over and get your free CD. <laughs> How would you like to have the brand new CD by Carrie Underwood? There you go. Y'all give her a hand. Come on. Thank you. And now everybody take it. Uh, hey, on the count. Hey, on the count of three. Hey, on the count of three, everybody take a drink. One, two, three. Take a big drink. All right, why? But why? Because if you bought your beer or liquor here, they probably make about ten dollars just now for that one drink. Oh, they probably make. <laughs> Put all y'all together, add it up. I guarantee you, ten bucks probably. Why you throw around? All right, I got, I got, I got one more question. I'm gonna ask you, and then we're gonna, oh, yeah, yeah. then we're gonna play some more music. Okay, y'all know Rick Flair, the wrestler. Yeah. Woo! All right, I didn't. I didn't know he'd been wrestling this, this long, but he's retired. But how many years did he wrestle? Professional. Rick Flair had wrestled 34 years. A little bit more. 36. A little bit more. 38. A little bit more. 40. You got it. Who said 40? I did. You got it. Come on. 40 years. He wrestled exactly 40 years professionally. Long time. Yes, he did. 40, 40 long years. Long, That's a long time hitting that ring hard on your back, ain't it? And then putting on that fake blood. <laughs> <laughs> How about Merle Hager's 16 hit? Love you. That, I think so. Thank you, sir. All right. All right. Good enough. Y'all hang around. I got about 40 to give away. I got, I got, I got some good questions to ask, so y'all hang around. Yes, sir. I don't go nowhere. Let's see. Look at George Jones. Thing. Do my rock 
walking on his head. Can't put this possum in the cage. My body is old, but it ain't in the I don't need no rocking chair. How about y'all? We don't need no rocking chair. I don't need no rocking chair. But it ain't in fair. Well, you know it ain't in fair. I don't need no rocking chair. Body's old, but it ain't in fair. I don't need no rocking chair. How about y'all? We don't need no rocking chair, do we? Uh, our cane either. Okay, thank you so much. We're gonna slow it down a little bit. I know you like to slow dance. And I love George Jones. How many George Jones fans we got in here? One of my favorite singers. Walk through this world oh, Where I Share all my dreams with me in life we sing, and some of us fly. I look for you a long, long time, and now that I Lodge over there in, in Greenville, of the South Greenville. Y'all might know his sister Margaret and uh, his little niece Donna that runs the bar. But anyway, he asked me tonight, he said, You gonna let me get up and sing? I said, Lord, yeah. I said, The people won't keep you get up and sing. Y'all wanna hear him sing one song too? Come on, up here, Jim. Put that camera around with you. Y'all come on up and we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna let him do a Hank Williams. Right. Are you happy to be here? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> One second, it's got a little bit. Say so you say so you happy. Can y'all see us? Huh? <laughs> he looked up, he looked up here and said, Is he crazy? <laughs> I know exactly what you're saying. Anyway. He's gonna sing a Hank Williams. There's a new movie out about Hank Williams. Have you seen it? 
It's a pretty movie. I mean, a, a, a beautiful singing in it. And uh, I didn't know Hank Williams' wife, Audrey, was beautiful like she is. But anyway, he goes. Yeah.
Thank you. We'll get him back up and let him do a couple more. He knows about four good songs, so we, uh, we'll get him back up and let him do the other two, you know. <laughs> Real quick, y'all, real quick. If y'all can tell me what city in South Carolina I was born, I'll give you a free CD. Anderson. Easily. Not easily, not Anderson. Greenville, Greenville. Right below Greenville. Timmonsville. I'd say, I'd say, I'd say from Greenville. Greenville. Not Timmonsville. Just say Travis Come on, man. Not Travis Ridge. Lamar. Uh, I'm about, uh, let's, let's see. Who said Belton? I did. You got it. Come on. Come on. Hey. 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 That man, that man right there, he come to win some CDs. Did, did you ever get a CD by me? No, sir. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to give you this one and give you another one. In case you don't like me, you can use that for a coaster. How about Hank Williams Jr., 22 hits? There you go. Thank you, my man. I got the brand new CD now released by Dolly Parton. It's got...